Hello friends, what did you ask me today? And a teeny tiny question. Is there a self? Well, I think this depends on how we define our terms. Often when we think about the self, we are thinking about some permanent thing that goes through life unchanging. And I'm not sure there's any aspect of our identities that is unchanging. Your religious convictions can change. Your gender or sexual identity can change. Your beliefs, your philosophical positions, your worldviews, your cells, your, I mean, everything can change. Your DNA can change. So what is the thing that never changes? That's a really difficult question. And I think that it can be dangerous to try to define ourselves. We talk about this a lot on this channel, but as soon as you decide I'm this kind of person, therefore I'm not that kind of person, you've really limited yourself. So rather than thinking about is there a self or is there not a self, I think it's better just to immerse ourselves in the moment and the experience. When you're in that flow state and you're just totally in the zone, then your notion of self, if it still exists, is gonna be very different from your notion of self when you're say, on a date or in a job interview and somebody says, tell me about yourself. And then what you're doing is you're describing a social construct, right? Well, I'm the person with this personality who has engaged in these types of activities and has these kinds of preferences and all that shit is just in the moment. And there's so much more to you than that. So this is a deep rabbit hole that can be very hard to get out of once you go down that journey. And that's okay. You don't have to stand out. You don't have to know who you are. You don't have to be a certain kind of self. You can just be, and then whatever happens, happens. So language may be getting in the way with the question like this. Maybe it's important to not even worry about it. Just see what the day brings, and then that's enough. We don't have to describe it. We don't have to label it. We don't have to internalize it. We can just have those experiences. I appreciate you asking such a tough question. Hopefully that got you thinking a little bit. Uh, this could be a dissertation, so I can only do it so much justice in a couple minutes here. But it is a fun one to think about, and I invite you all to continue thinking about it. Please share your thoughts in the comments. Please like this video. Please subscribe to my channel, and I will see you back here next time.